This is my daughter Dasha, and uh, she just shared a story with me in the car about her hip hop dance practices. Um. So, mom, what did you tell me before that? I asked. Uh, I said, usually. What I said is that before, I did not used to uh, encourage and uh, say nice words to my daughter when she accomplished something because I felt like she didn't try her best. And uh, I would see all the people who are cheering for their kids even though they didn't do their best. I would think, well, uh, why would you encourage somebody who didn't try hard enough and didn't finish um, in the uh, in the best uh, with the best results so I would only say nice words and say well you did great only if she did great the best and she would always come up to me and say uh, mommy did I do a good job mommy did I do a good job and uh, I would only say yes only if she did the greatest job so it was my limited thinking and now that I learned what you need to do is say well you tried your best you did great but if you if you did put a little bit more into that if you practiced more or if you did uh, try a little bit harder then you would be doing even better so you kind of say it in the middle you encourage her but then you, you say, you can do it even better if you feel like it. So she shared with me a story about her dance hip-hop practice. So she can tell the story herself. So I'm like, so she told me the story, my mom told me the story, and then I'm like, oh, mom, it's like the same thing like in dance class. Like our teacher, she's not really grumpy or anything. It's just like she's um, sometimes very mean. Well, not really mean, she, she just like gets, like her nerves are very sensitive. She's very sensitive, she likes to yell at us. Well, she doesn't like to yell, she yells. And when we do um, the wrong stuff, like if one person messes up, um, when we're doing our dance routine, she makes us stop and do the whole routine all over again. And, um, we can do it five times, we can do it ten times, we can do it fifteen times, we can do it twenty times. And then she's only sat satisfied when um, we do like our absolute best and we're like sweating and we're like all smiling and everything and nobody messed up. And that's only when she says that it, you did a good job. So, uh, so I'm like, but that's not fair because we're trying our best and we're trying to do something. So it's always better to try your hardest than just not to try your hardest. You also said that she encourages you and says you can do better, you can do better. Yeah, that, like you can do better. No, no, not you. You can do better. Straighten up your legs. Um, make that turn like you feel like it. Straighten up your legs. Stand closer. Don't lose your spot. Stuff like that. And she, she makes... She really gets us tired, but she does it for a good reason, because now we're dancers! We're awesome! And also, practice makes perfect, right? Yeah, practice makes perfect, everybody, so practice! No, I mean, d did she tell you, like, start all, all over again and practice oh, again? Oh, yeah, she did. She's like, um, so, like, so, like, during the dance routine, there's, like, Boom, 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 twist, turn, la, 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 blah, 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 boom, somebody fall, somebody twists their leg and then bends their leg. And then does the routine. And then she's like, oh, no, stop, that person did the wrong thing. You need to straighten out your leg next time. Let's start over and do it again. And that's what makes it do, like, five times, ten times, fifteen times. And she just does that to us. And practice makes perfect. So she does that to a good reason. So shout out, thank you.